share with you today this Pacifica palette that I've been using a lot lately. Um, it's their Natural Minerals Coconut Infused palette. This isn't just eyeshadows though. This one actually has some highlighters. They're like a, it's kind of unique actually. I've never seen anything like it, like a cream type highlighter. At first I thought that these were, this top row, I thought it was lip glosses and I was like, meh, I don't know about that. But they're actually highlighters and it's really neat. I've got this palette on today. I've been using it the past few days. So there's three highlighters on the top, and then there is a blush shade and then a bronzer shade. Both of those I have on today, and then there's six different natural mineral color eyeshadows. So there's a gold, which is really pretty actually. I've got this one on the outer third of my eye. Really, really love it. It's a very true yellow gold. Then the next one is a light pink. I really like that too if you're just trying to do like a quick out the door neutral eye but have a little bit of shimmer. So this uh, end color here, it's kind of like a, it's similar to the bronzer color but then it's got a nice shimmer to it. Really really love that one, you can use it in the crease, I've been doing that a lot. And then the shade on the bottom is kind of like a peachy pink orange color. I think it's really neat for summer and that's also another one I've been going to just for all over the lid and then I've been using that shimmery the color for it um, in the crease. Today I actually have on this blue, it's kind of like a turquoise blue, light blue. I actually think this is really pretty just all over the lid and like I said I've got this gold on the outer third. I was a little bit weary about having a blue eyeshadow like all over the lid but I, I personally think it looks really nice and it's an easy way for me to wear blue. Um, I find it's really difficult to wear blue with blue eyes sometimes, so I did that, and I actually took it around um, to the tear duct area and a little bit below too, and I thought that was cool. And then the last color here is a dark chocolate brown, and it's got some, kind of like some sparkles in it, and that one I used just to put over my eyeliner, and then I'll kind of smoke it out with this shade, and I think it's nice. You can also darken up the crease with it if you want. Really pretty, and I was actually really impressed with this palette. Um, like I've got on the contour today, I've got on the blush, and then with the eyeshadows, they just seem like you can come up with so many different looks that look so different. Um, I usually go more towards my natural colors, like the browns and, I don't know, browns and reds and taupe and stuff, but this has a nice blend of neutrals with some that are a little bit just just different, I guess, than what I normally gravitate towards. So if you've got a neutral palette and this, you can have so many looks, um, or even just straight this. I think the only thing I'm missing out of this palette is maybe like a matte white or a matte cream, like for the under brow bone highlight, or if you want to do like a matte inner tear duct or something like that. Um, that one's kind of missing out on this, but other than that, I really, really like the combination, and I love that it's just in a nice little palette, easy go-to. If you want to see a look with this palette, let me know down in the comments, and I can do like a dedicated tutorial out of it if you want to see that. Um, and then the highlight colors, I was going to mention this too. I have on this middle bubblegum pink shade. Um, today I've got that on my cupid's bow and a little bit on the tops of my cheekbones and I really really like that. My preference or my favorite one out of all the highlighters I would definitely say is the yellow toned one. I just think it matches my more yellow based skin tone the best and um, yeah I really really like it and I really love the fact that they're a cream highlighter because they're just super smooth and really easy to just like put on and then kind of blend out just a little bit and they add that nice little extra like natural look I guess. It, it's easier to do a glowy look I think with something that's more, I don't know, like of a cream highlighter and I've never really thought about that before. So really love it and it seems like they have a really nice natural finish. The only other con I can think of with the palette is that it's a little bit, I mean if you're worried about for travel and having something really really slim and sleek, um, it is pretty thick. I've seen palettes you know with the same amount of product that would probably be half the size um, I like the feel of it though, being as big as it is, and it's very sturdy, even being the kind of like paperboard wrapping type of um, type of material. So it's nice in that aspect, but if you're trying to go with something super, super trim for travel, or you've got a lot of palettes and you need to store them, probably not the best that way, but it does feel nice. And if you are new to the idea of a makeup palette, I think it's nice and it feels really sturdy. So I hope you guys enjoyed the review. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you've ever tried anything from Pacifica, let me know what some of your favorites are, your thoughts, and we will see you again soon. Bye guys. Oh, I don't know if I can pick that's, a one. That's brown. That is brown. <laughs> You're that, that, that's red. Oh, well, are you gonna take over this for me? No, that's pink. Okay, Carter's gonna review the palette. <laughs> he knows more about it than that's, me. This, this, this is, this is blue. That is. Do I have blue in my eyes right now? No. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah, I do. 
I lean a lot, okay. Want me to put it on me? You wanna put it on me? Maybe I'll have you do my makeup one day. Thumbs up if you wanna see Carter do my makeup one day. No, right now. Right now? I already did my makeup today. I wanna do it right now. If this video gets enough thumbs up, I will let Carter do my makeup. Do you want me to let you done? <laughs> well, maybe in a few days, maybe. Maybe. No, not now. <laughs>